Let's go. Welcome back to another episode of Dan Geesing Beats a Walking Dead. And where we last left off it was a little bit of a cliffhanger. And we needed to find Clem in the backyard. And let's see Clementine? if she's back here. Clementine! Come on, Clem, where are you? Clem, don't do this to us. Look at Lee's focus face. So the doctor's inside working on Omid. Maybe she's in the doghouse. Nope. Where the heck is she? She better not have got stolen by the walkie-talkie guy. Where the heck is she? I don't think she's in there, sir. Please don't be walkers in there. What were you doing, sir? Hey, girl. Come look. Look what I found. We were so, such a softy. I'm such a softy. You can't yell at her. What'd she find? Clem! The savior! <laughs> Holy shit. Swear. <laughs> nice job, Clem. Clem, the life bringer. Nicely done, Clem. She's pulling her weight around here, I'll tell you that much. That's probably why she went to go find us to tell us about the boat. Maybe. Who knows what's going on in Clem's mind. How's Omid doing, sir? Omid's doing okay? As well as can be expected under the circumstances. I did what I could for him. Cleaned out the wound, but he's got a real infection. Running a fever. Pour Without some whiskey on it, sir. I... Will you quit pacing? You're making everyone nervous. Red Why Ninja, be here? quiet. Hey, if your friend really can get that boat working, you're taking me with you as payment for saving your asses. I figure that's fair enough, don't you? Kenny got it working. Well? You want the good news or the bad news? Good news. I think we could all use some good news. Good news is the boat's seaworthy enough. In pretty good shape, mostly. Mostly? That's the bad news. The bad news, news we got a gas tank's okay. empty and her battery's dead. We need to fix both before she's taken. I thought I say we're gonna we have to well, pick people to go. To get that stuff? What about Crawford? Sounds like Crawford is the one place that has everything we need. Maybe we should try there. Now hold on a minute. Surely we have to try. If there are people left in this city who are still alive, who still have supplies, what harm can it do to They're ask? killers. Trust me, you don't know these people. I do. You showing up with a wounded man, might as well put a noose around his neck. They don't exactly welcome children with open arms either. What the hell kind of a place are we talking about here? The worst kind? But I don't see what other choice we have. And just how exactly do you figure we do this? Like bosses. Because from what I've heard, that place ain't exactly friendly to outsiders. We sneak there in. There be some way we can sneak in there undetected. There might actually be a way. I know the sewer system that runs beneath Crawford like the back of my hand. Dr. Vernon. Y'all wouldn't happen to have a map by any chance. Yeah, actually. Lee. I think I could lead us through so we could pass under the perimeter and right into the center where they keep their supplies. We come up Let's right do underneath it. them, take them by surprise, grab what we need, and get out before they even knew what hit them. That's actually not the worst idea I've ever heard. Red Negative Ninja is her new name. I don't know. Maybe it could work. I've thought about it before, just never had the people to do it. But I think if we all work together, we could pull it off. 
Just a what second ago he said he didn't want to go. Help you're giving us. Crawford doesn't just have what you need for your boat. They're also well stocked with medical supplies. Medicine that my people could use, just as yours could. We can do this. We have to. So, Kristen. it's decided then? We're going to Crawford? We can do this. I know it. Hell yeah, we can. Are we seriously talking about this? Ben. <laughs> I mean, what about the risk? I don't know about you, kid, but I'd rather take a chance on doing something than just sitting around here waiting to die. That boat out there is an answered prayer. Kenny, gotta push Kenny's a boat. Bit farther. Are you in or out? We should go tonight. She's coming. Under cover what else are you gonna do, Ben? I'll go let my people know. Give you all a chance to prepare. I'll be back before midnight. Be careful. That's how I'm still alive. Krista bossing. I told you to stay in your room. How long have you been there? That Clem and Lee theme music. Dangerous? It's what gonna be dangerous? Crawford. I can't lie to you, Clem. Yeah, it's gonna be dangerous. But it's the only way to get the things we need to make Sorry, Clem. and get the boat working. That's why we have to do this. Do you understand? She's a grown up. I don't want anyone else to die. No one else is gonna die. I promise. How can we promise that? You can't promise that. <laughs> no, I guess I can't. Sorry. I guess I should go get ready. Uh, say what now? You said you'd need all of us to do this. And you said I'm a big help, remember? Molly said Crawford is the only place left in Savannah that still has people. That means it must be where my mom and dad are, No, right? we cannot let that happen. It's dangerous where for I'm children. Going, it's just too dangerous. For children especially. You said I'm supposed to always stay close to you. Can't I come with you? Clem, you can't come this time. Ah. Okay, you can come, but you have to promise to stay quiet and do exactly what you're told the whole time we're there. Okay, I'm gonna go get ready. Hope we don't regret that. She can't trust her with Ben. Oh man. Putting your child in harm's way. But it's just, you couldn't, I, decision making, we can't stay separated. Just can't. We saw what happens. She roams the streets. Check out what I found in the garage. Hatchet, hacksaw, some other tools. Might come in handy on this little break-in. Nice. Can I talk to you a minute? What's up? I took another look at the boat. She's a 30-footer. So? So, we're gonna have a capacity problem. Assuming everyone makes it back alive... This is what I was worried about. Everyone. What are you trying to say? Just giving you a heads up is all. Thought you ought to know. And there's more. Who the hell is this? Debbie Downer. This is Bree. She can help us. How? Help us how? I was a student at the school where Crawford keeps their supplies. I know the layout. With her help, we're in and out faster. Anyone have a problem with that? I guess not. Then what are we waiting for? Let's get moving. We strike at night, sirs. Clem needs a hoodie. Hold up just a sec. You ready? Ready. Hey, whoa, hold on a minute. You're not taking her with us. Did you not hear anything I said about the kind of place Crawford is? This isn't up if for you debate, take her sir. In there and they find her? This isn't up for debate, Vernon. Decisions made. For what it's worth, I don't think it's a great idea either. She's coming. Deal with it. You heard the man. Let's move out. <laughs> ben, just give me that. You, you can't handle that weapon, Ben. Just, just stop. What were we going to do? Leave Clementine with Omid? That's it? 
No way. This should be it. We're right underneath the center of Crawford. The old school should be directly above us. Okay, people. This is it. Remember the plan. We stay quiet, we stay hidden, and we stay together. We find what we need, and we get the hell out before anyone even knows we're there. Such a big Got group. It? And that part about staying close, it goes double for you. Can't get a good look above with the cover on. Let's do it. Closer. Let's go. Oh, there's their weapon. See that in the corner? That pry Where's weapon. Everybody? There should be guards patrolling. What? Are you disappointed? Shh, you guys are being too loud. I think I see one over there by the door. Looks like a walker. Okay. Me and Kenny will sneak up trying to take him out quiet. The rest of you wait for our signal. Why are we taking summer. out guards? Everybody got it? Okay, Kenny, let's do this quiet. No shooting unless there's no other choice. Right behind you. That's a walker, that's not a person. I like our hatchet though. What the fuck? Smash him. Smash him! Where's our freaking cursor? Come on. That was fast. Okay. Me and Kenny will sneak up, try to take him out. These are getting some good lead death scenes. Wait for our signal, then follow us over. Everybody got it? Okay, Kenny, let's do this. These death way. scenes are way better. No eh, I can't say that. No other choice. Right behind Never mind. you. You can tell by the way he's moving. It's a walker. Keep our cursor high, sir. What, what the, the fuck? Beep. He's got a pearl for a night. Where is it? Smash him. Why are they all dead? Take that red what bandana, the fuck sir. Is a walker doing inside here? Get inside! Fast! Where's Clem? Clem, stay away from Ben. <laughs> We're in school, high school. Fuck. Fuck! Do you think they saw us? No idea, sir. Your guess is as good as mine. Your answer what scared the hell Clementine happened away. here? I thought this place was supposed to be secure. What always happens, I guess. In the end, the dead always win. Oh man, we are so screwed. I thought Ben was a walker right there. No, this is good. How is this good, sir? What? How the fuck is this good? Before, everyone in Crawford was smart and they had guns. Now they're dumb and they don't. Hey, trying to look on the bright side here. Dr. Vernon, I like you, sir. like I that agree. attitude. So long as we don't let him box us in, we can still do this. The plan hasn't changed. The plan hasn't changed? Every time walkers show up, the plan changes. Do you even have any idea how many of them are out there? No. You want to do a head count? Or do you want to get what we need and get the hell out of here? Putting Ben in his place dot com. Come on. I think I know which way to head. I got a bad feeling about this. And we're going to take that cutscene from Ben. Since we all think Ben's a troll. At least I think Ben's a troll. We're going to end this episode of Danny Geesing Beats a Walking Dead. And when we return, we're going to find out what Ben's bad feeling is all about. If you enjoyed this video, you can let me know by hitting the like button below. And if you're new to the channel and you haven't yet subscribed, I encourage you to do so so that you know the next time a video is released. Thank you guys so much for watching, watching and I'll see you 
on the other side, sirs.